Hey guys, welcome back to Nino Kuni. I'm here at the castle. I skipped uh, me running through the castle because I'm sure you guys have already seen it. You don't want to see me running through the castle again. I gotta drop off Mackison because I'm still in the past. I gotta drop Mackison off so I can get back to my time. Oh, the Emperor! Your Majesty! Uh, <gasps> Father! Uh, but why? What happened? Shut sure. Shadar. Shadar? Yes. He was here. He came to... to... demand our unconditional surrender. Huh? But, but let it be known. I defied him. I would not bow to that wretch. No, don't. Don't try to speak. <coughs> Gascon. Huh? My son. My beloved son. Huh? You really thought I couldn't tell? You knew? Your appearance may have changed. But I know my own flesh and blood. What the future holds is a mystery to all men. But I know, I know that together, you and Marcuson can, I believe in you, protect the Empire, now and in the future. wanted to make you proud and now this has to happen damn it Swain. I wonder what's taking Swain so long I just can't believe he's that he's Gascon the heir to all of the Hamlin, my mind's boggled beyond all belief, Mon. I guess he didn't want us to know, huh? I suppose. It wouldn't be the same now, now that we know that he's the prince. Well, I'm gonna act like I don't know. <laughs> Me too, unless Swain wants to talk about it. I'm not gonna say a word. Uh oh, you don't need to worry about me, Mon. I haven't forgotten all about this a bit. I couldn't remember if it, if I wanted to. If there's one thing I'm good at, it's forgetting. Uh, sorry to keep you waiting. Swain? Well, I suppose it's time to go. But I need to say a goodbye to Mackison first. Alright. It's today, and that's your leaving, isn't it? Yes, your highness. Thank you for everything. No, no, I should be thanking you. Because of you, I was able to become my father's heir, and soon I'll formally inherit his title. Yeah, I'll bet the people of Hamlin are glad about that at all. I mean to give them a reason but I wanted them to know that they have nothing to fear but fear itself. I mean, um, fear from Shadar. I refuse to let him defeat us. I want Gascon to be able to come back to Hamlin whenever he likes. After all, I must keep the Empire safe until he does so. You'll make a fine Emperor, Makasan. Gascon would be proud of you. I hope so. He always believed in me, and I shall never stop believing that he will come back soon. Look at your locket, Ollie boy. It's all glow, man. You don't know. It must be Makasan's belief, and his brother must be real strong. 
I'm sorry, I... Your Highness, there's something who... Someone who needs your help. Someone who needs some of your strength. That's in your heart. My heart? Whoever are you talking about? Well, you, Your Highness. In the future, I mean. It's our time. A piece of your heart is missing. My future self. That's right. And we need you to share it for some of your belief with him to help him go back to normal. My belief? Well, very well. I can hardly refuse my own future self a piece of my heart. Ugh. All right, let's take it. Let's take this little kid's heart. Nothing happens. What am I supposed to do? Oh, I gotta talk to him. I could have just, you know, did that while I was talking to him. But no, I had to come up to him and talk to him. Alright, I got what he needs. A new one. The noble certainty of unshakable faith. Definitely different um, expressions or feelings than I was thinking when I first played. Thank you very much, your highness. There is no need to thank me now, please. Give that belief to my future self immediately. I mean, when I'm older. But before you go, Swain. Oh, yes. When you return to your time, please give my regards to my future brother. Uh, I'll be sure to do that, your highness. Alright, oh. Back to the future it is. You know which spell you want to do, don't you, Ollie boy? Breach time, ain't it? Roger. Let's go, everybody. To the future. Alright, so. Where is new spells? Huh? Breach time. So I'm gonna have this useless spell in my spell book. Hopefully they get rid of it, because I don't want it to be in the way. Of spells that I actually use. together. Today, today tomorrow, tomorrow, yesterday, yesterday send, send us safely, safely on, on our way. way. <gasps> okay, now you guys gotta pick a time. Pick a time. Oh, oh, they're just gonna send you back further into the past. Oliver's gone. They've all gone. Did we make it? Um... Aren't we still in the same place? No way, Mon. That's impossible. I know. When a spell works, and that spell worked. Right and proper. We're back in our time, no doubt about it. Yeah, this place is different somehow. Swain? We made it back. That's all that matters. Now, isn't there someone we should be helping? Of course. Come on. Oliver, let's go find Moccasin. Sure thing, let's go find his belief back. Now, if I remember correctly, the guards are coming after me, so I better hurry up. Hurry up! Don't forget to skip and a hop, skip and a hop, skip and a hop. There we go. Jump for Mr. Drippy. Because he doesn't know how to. He's not doing his teleport thing. I remember when I was last here, he was like jumping here and there and everywhere. Wow, you're like taller than me now. Wow, look how much taller you are, young boy. And you don't... Why are you dressed like that in such a plain outfit like that? Get out of here. Go. Be gone, I say. Poor lad. Still heartbroken. That's for definite. A shadow of his former self, he is. He needs a dose of belief, he does. And a snappy. Come on, man. It's what his dad would have done and wanted. Cease your meddling chatter, fairy. My father died 15 years ago. Did you not claim to know he his will? So all that carry-on was 15 years ago, was it? And this poor lad has been on his own ever since. That is tragic. Uh, your highness, we brought you something, a gift. It's your 15 years ago. We got it from, well, we got it from you. Anyway, if it's only... It's if, oh, if it's okay, we'd like you to have it back. What did you say? What is this meaning of is this?
Uh, before we give him that, let's give him some enthusiasm, and some kindness, and restraint, and some courage, and, uh, whatever. Alright, belief it is. Because he's going to join our team later. He's going to be our fourth character. So we're going to need him nice and strong. What is this? This glow? Oh, what's happening? What is this warm and it spreads within my breast? What have I been doing? All this time I've been so misguided. It was Shaddai, your highness. He took your belief from your heart. My heart? My belief? What? Wait, I feel... I believe in people once more. I want to believe in more people. It has been so long since I felt this way. Does this mean... Does this mean that you've saved me? Was it you who gave me back my capacity to believe? It was, your highness. I did promise, didn't I? I promised I'd come and help you if you were in trouble, wherever you were, no matter how far away. Wherever I... I see. <laughs> now I see. You came back. I always knew you would. Thank you. That's really uh, no need to thank me, your highness. Your highness, we need your help. We want you to help us to defeat Shada. What did you say? You mean to face Shada? That is impossibly reckless. I am a great sage, and yet Shada was able to enter my heart and take a piece of it with impunity. And yet I was saved, just as I was promised. Very well, I shall assist you. Together we shall defeat the Dark Dinj. Shada's days are numbered. They are. They sure are. Well, thank you much, your highness. I knew you would let us down. Um, and that is why you, the Emperor, Moccasin. So why do you still call him Swainy? Swainy. Well, well. What are we to make of this? It seems the Savior managed to acquire Mornstar after all. And somehow managed to travel back to the present. I would have thought that far beyond his meager power. Indeed. The power to breach time can be used but once in a mortal's life, can it not? It would seem that he has benefited from yet more assistance. And that his benefactor possesses formidable powers. Powers on a par with our own. This supposed helper of his is no mere dabbler in the magical arts. Such powers recall those of that ancient king without whom our magic wands could not exist. Yes, I speak of my... But that would be a truly terrifying proposition, if one such as he were to... Fear not. Should the need arise, I shall take action myself. Your radiance? You mean to say... <laughs> I do. He cannot hope to defeat me. And I will tell you why. All right, everyone, listen. In order to defeat Shadar, we must first break down his defenses. Now, the Dark Dungeon is protected by a magical barrier known as the Black Barrier. The Black Briar? Yes, I meant Briar, not Barrier. But it is cloying magical barrier which is no spell can permeate. Neither Rashad nor Alicia were able to overcome the Black Barrier. That is why Shada was able to defeat them. And with the other great sages incapitated, he was able to de delve deep into my own heart and steal a piece of it. But now, Makasin, oops, I mean, your majesty. Come along now, Esther. I once fought alongside you as a child. There are no need for you to use royal titles. The same goes for all of you. Share your majesty. Um, dang you, boy, don't you listen? Don't worry, Oliver. I'm sure you'll get used to it. Now, I would 
dearly love to accompany you on another journey. One where we grow strong and old together. Strong enough to defeat Shada. But protecting the Empire has to be my first priority. There is also a small matter of rectifying the many mistakes I've made whilst heartbroken and brokenhearted. I comfort myself with the knowledge that you now possess a wand that should enable you to defeat Shadar without my aid, Oliver. Monstar once belonged to the Wizard King. It is said to have power to overcome any enchantment. That must surely include the Black Briar that protects Shadar. Unforgettably, Unfortunately, however, the wand you have in your possession is not complete. Uh, not complete? What are you talking about? Monstar's true power is beyond most wizards' comprehension, Harry. It is so powerful indeed that Ancient King has created it, decided that its power should be divided between three magical stones. These three stones were then sealed away. Far from the wand itself. So we need to go and find the rat. Yes, but I have apology to make in that regard. What? What did you do? What have you done? A map detailing the location of these three stones was once in my possession, I'm afraid. However, that it has been stolen. Stolen? While I was heartbroken, I mean brokenhearted, sorry. I must confess that I become rather neglectful of a palace, treasures, books, and maps would often disappear. To my shame, I actually observed several such thefts and did nothing. I'm sorry. That sounds about right. I uh, found it hard to care about anything much when I was brokenhearted. Well, this is a bit um, rum. If the thief who pinched the maps uses it to get a hold of the stones, what do you think he's doing with them right now? I think the thief was Swain. I don't know. What I do now, however, is the identity of the Zeth thief. His name is Kublai. Kublai! He styles himself King of the Sky Pirates. Oh yeah, you know what? This is where I thought, um, I thought Kublai was going to be his older brother when it ended up being Swainy. I was wrong. But it's Kubla. Kubla? Of all the people that be tangled with. I should have known you two would uh, be thick as erm. Anyway, I don't suppose you know where he is, do you? That's the thing with the Sky Pirates. You never know where they are. They're always moving from hideout to hideout in these giant airships. Well, I've already been there, so I know where he is. You're welcome, everybody. But that, as it may be locating, Kubla is still the easiest way for you to recover the three magical stones. He is very unlikely to cooperate peacefully, however, I have had better teach you some new spells. And I say you better teach me ones that I can use. That, that blubber fish that Drippy calls a mum gave me some spells and I can't use not one of them. She gave me tons of them. Ward. Ward doesn't do anything. Fuse. Well, that might do something. Combine two things. Insight. Okay. Some insight. Well, I hope I can use these. You will almost certainly be doing a lot of traveling on your search for Kubla. Therefore, let me grant you one last spell. Well, you could have just, you know... Oh, travel! Ooh, this is great. This is a great time in the game. Now that I have traveled, travel is the most important spell you get in the game. Because now I don't have to walk everywhere or sail anywhere or do anything. I could just travel. I guess the places I've already been. What does it do, yo? Um, uh, I mean, uh, Mackison. It instantly transports you to any location you've already been. While I was unable to accompany you on your travels... I can at least make you then pass more comfortably. Well, that's great. It means we can come and see you anytime we like, Mackinson. 
Ha, indeed. Be sure to use it to return to some of the other places you have visited on your journey and find out what has changed. You, if you visit the Temple of Trials, for example, you will now be able to take part in the Salasium Sol series, organized by my old teacher, Salam. Oh, wow. I think she just farted. She, like, like blew her hand where she just farted, and she just, you know, kind of blew it towards everybody else. You can always rewind that and take a look at that. Oh, wow. I almost completely forgot about Solomon and the Temple of Trials. Our first priority, though, is to find Kubla, King of the Sky Pirates. Come on, Oliver. The next chapter of our adventure starts here. It sure does. Let's go. So... It's not a big deal that we don't have the dragon. The dragon um, has its perks, even though I can teleport. The good thing about the dragon is that I can go to places that I would not normally be able to walk to, because the dragon can fly. How's Oliver not older and he's older? Well, Oliver um, traveled time, where this kid stayed in his time. That's why he is older now. Let's see what this does. Palace Entrance. Wow, everyone's fat again. And they're not wearing outfits. But they're all fat. And I see someone very important. Very, very important. This guy. It's time to find his diary. Not now, but to ask him where it is. Well, I say it's you, dear boy. It feels like an absolute age since our grant on a delightful fairy island. What? You have an impeccable timing, you know? Uh, we do? Ten guilders say he's lost his diary again. But how? Looks like I won a little bet. Didn't I? Ollie boy, careless so-and-so. I am most dreadful and ashamed. Uh, there I was merely uh, pootling along the open road when some lootish monsters assailed me. I took fright and fled to the city to the nearest outpost of the civilization I could find. And then you thought you'd write all about it in your precious diary, only to find out that the thing has gone missing again, right? Precisely. My gift to literature has vanquished once again. But you'll help me find it, won't you, old bean? Now, every city I go to, I have to help him out. So, uh, yes, I will help you out. Because I'm going to need those uh, five stamps you're going to give me so I can upgrade my guy. Well, I guess we can help you find it again, mister. Oh, you sure will. Oh, I say. That is really awfully good of you, Ollie boy. Hold on, man. If we're going to be chasing down by monsters, you couldn't have dropped it just about anywhere. Well, I think I can enlighten you as to my general location. At the time of the incident, I had a happen upon the most intriguing little mine. Overcome by curiously, I... Couldn't help uh, popping in for a quick poke around, and that's when I, when the beast arrived. So you're surrounded by monsters. Yes, that's about the size of it, so if I were to hazard a guess, I would say the diary is at the railway tracks near the mine entrance. So it's on the some railroad track near the entrance to a mine. Got it. And that sounds about easy. Yo, I might have what you need now. He wants courage. I believe I do have courage. Maybe I don't have courage because it's probably the one I don't have. All right. So on my daughter's file, this plant here is broke. Because I'm supposed to, like she says, rejuvenate the plant. Well, maybe to work on my file. Maybe it's just her, um, her profile is broken. All I have to do is like quick and grow. Nothing happens. Um, I 
rejuvenate. Uh, Alright, well, mine's broke too. Can I poison it? Insight? Boom, boom. Hey, look, insight works. That move that he gave me. Ward. Protects the caster from magical attacks and re reducing the damage sustained from spells and tricks. Hmm. Well, I guess it's broke. Forever. What does this do? Take me back to the castle? To the entrance of Hamlin. No. I want to uh, see something here. Ah, yes. Green dots. New hearts have arrived. Now I'm going to need those. Probably new hearts because I have a new heart. Yep, so he's got belief. That's why he's new. This is good. I can travel around looking for people that need these. And I give them to them. The other heart is right up here. up here. I already talked to everybody down there. Or no, I didn't talk to that one I see there in the corner. Let's just talk to all these guys up here. Let's see what everybody up here wants. This is a good time because as soon as you get to this point in the game, they have uh, people all over. Since you have travel, every city that you've been to now have missions and stuff. Hearts, mostly. Yo, what do you want? He's looking for kindness. So let's give him some kindness. All right, nobody cares. Why are you still wearing a big suit? Don't you know what the thing's over? Everyone took off their. Ooh, nice. Everyone took off their uh, pig face, but they didn't take off their pig suit. Everyone still walk around like they're fat when they're not fat. Can I do something here now? I thought so. Something special is going on here. I always come in here and check out. It's a black market. There's always creeps coming in here like this guy. Oh, there's nothing quite like an honest day's work, except for the honest afternoon nap yawn. And I am feeling rather. Oh, wait, wake up. Uh, you idle limp. I pray you to work. Come, come on. Chop, chop. I'm sorry, Gunna. What's he got into you lately? I'm sleeping on the job, I ask you. Any more of this nonsense and you'll be for the high jumper. So this must be the employee and he's tired because this guy here is overworking him. That's my guess. All right, Gunna. I roll up my sleeves and I walk off. I... Hey, wake up, mister. Your boss is, will fire you. Didn't you know? Yo, oi, you. You want this job or not? Yes, I love my work. I just, that when I get sleepy, I guess I can't resist, I guess. I got it. What Sleeping Beauty's missing is some good old fashioned restraint. Oh, I just said no. I just said no. Oh, bad, bad juju. I gotta listen to all that again. And I believe I have some restraint right here. Oh, 
Well, now I feel better. Thank you. Now I'm awake. Ooh, I got some a drowsy drop gem. And that gem will give somebody the move drowsy drops. Which will put the enemy to sleep. More stamps. Yes, now I can build up my stamp book. You know, I think that when I get Maccasin is when I can open this, because I have the wand now. Actually, I think I also have to repair the wand. Yeah. Still not strong enough. Either I need Maccasin, or I need the other half of that wand, or something. But most likely, Maccasin, when he joins the team, he'll be able to open that chest, just like his brother can open chests I can't open. Didn't I just help this guy? What do you want now? Agree to help the researcher with this problem. Collect some feel-good fungi for me. Okay. Where's your fungi? Growing in the forest of the west of the city. Sure, we'll get him some fungi. We'll get that later. Right now, we're just running around the city collecting some things. Like, this money that someone left in a pot is now mine. Just like in Zelda, except uh, Zelda is not as nice as me. He likes to break pots. Or Link. Link likes to break pots where I don't break their pots. I just steal from them. You and the cape. Just where in the world have you come from? Me, sir? Where do I come from? Um, well, you see, the thing is, can't give me a straight answer, huh? Well, I've got it. You're a spy, aren't you? Huh, a spy? No, sir. I'm just, that's all, not all, and I mean, I'm just a kid. That's quite enough of your back chat. I know a spy when I smell it. Hold on, you're, there's another one. Aren't you undercover? The whole spy ring? Uh, you're accusing the Lord High Lord of the Fairies of being a spy, a lovable character like me. Enough of your chatter. You're not from Hamlin, therefore you're a spy. End of bleeding story. Oh, niggers. Either this guard is broken hearted or I'm a flippin' spy, so suspicious so and so lost his belief. Okay, you have belief. I think I just grabbed belief from somebody. I will. Get, oh, I'm not gonna kill him, I'm just gonna give him belief. There we go. And all we got left now is enthusiasm. Now he doesn't go around accusing everybody of being spies because it's crazy. Now I believe I have this guy's two uh, robots, and the other good thing is that he's standing at the same place as this, so they always make it easy to switch out your guys. Let's put this guy in here. This guy in here. Grab the two robots he wants. Now, let's see if we got what he wants. Wants? It would appear you have successfully identified both the large and small mechanical creature. I think you'll find that what you're missing is a brown cog shaped creature. Oh, oh brown. Oh, cog. Ugh. Alright, guys. I'm gonna take some time to go find this brown cog, and I will be back. Hmm, just feeding my guy here a uh, toadstool sundae. Actually, I gave it to these two, so. Now, this one actually looks like it wants to eat a toadstool sundae. Yeah, eat that. Okay, so it took me three days to catch the guy I was looking for. Let's see. So I needed to catch this guy. And... It is very hard to, to find them. Well, I know where exactly where they're at, but it's very hard for them to pop up. And then it's even harder to uh, catch them because uh, they put the hearts up. They almost never put the heart up for this guy. 
So this guy was so hard to catch. It was took me three days, and I played hours. In fact, if you look at my level, my guys now, I was probably in the 30s, uh, mid 30s or late, low, uh, higher 30s when I started this. And now my guys, the three of them are up high. He's at 39, 42, 45. The only reason why these guys are one is because these aren't my guys. But, um, yeah. So let's, you know, show this guy his uh, prize. And it better be worth it. He's probably only going to give me far less stamps than I require. Alright. Give me my stamps, boy. Uh, he didn't give me, well, he gave me quite a bit here. This is pretty good. Maybe he knew it would take eh, a good amount of stamps to teach them out. I hope it doesn't take you guys as long as it took me to catch him. My daughter said that she caught him pretty easily. She didn't have a problem with this, but for me, it took forever. Three days. Alright, well that's it for this video. Thank, thank you for watching, and if you haven't, please like and subscribe. Bye-bye.